Hello everyone, I'm Kay and I do big reviews. For those who are new to my channel, hello. And to those who are coming back, thank you. Nice to see you again. So today I'm going to review the Jameson wig by Aesthetica, my very first Aesthetica wig. So if you want to find out what I think about it, stay tuned. <music> Is the Jameson in the color RH1488RT8. So what that basically means it's a dark honey blonde with light amber uh, gold blonde highlights. I hope you can see that in that light and with a medium golden brown root. Very beautiful color, very natural looking. Like your hairdresser did a really good job. I think it is very similar to John Renault's 12 FS8, which I have here for comparison. So this is the John Renault and this is the Aesthetica and look how similar they are. I can't really tell any difference between them. So if you love the John Renault, that Aesthetica color might be for you as well. Okay, so really a lovely color. Let's look at the cap construction. It has a lace front, temple to temple. It has a mono part. It rest is wefted cap and you have these hook adjusters rather than the velcro or the bra adjusters so you hook them in the spot where you need it so overall fairly classic cap construction quite lightweight really nice movement and i will put her on and then you can see what she's like on my head and here is Jameson. So what I first noticed is really nice movement. Very soft fibers, but really quite natural movement. So let's look at the lace front. I think they did a really good job on this lace front. I think it's really nice. Very natural looking. Monopart. Again, actually really nice. I might still would like to pluck it a little bit, but that's just me. I don't think you necessarily have to. So let's look at Jameson from all sides. So this is the front, my left hand side, my right hand side, and the back. Really nice natural movement, I think. So, yeah, really nice long layered bob there for you. It's it, when I look at it, I'm not sure it is for me, to be very honest. But as I just said, I just got it out of the box, literally, haven't done anything to it. And it's still, for me, to me, it looks wiggy. But when, you, when that happens to you, don't panic. Most of the time, they do fall into themselves after you wear them for a little while. So they then become a little bit, bit more real looking, if you like. But yeah, I think it's a really nice movement. I just want to do this all the time. So I really like that. Now, as you can see, I do this a lot. She does want to fall into your face. So you either need to steam her off, off, off your face like this, or what I always do is just put a little clip in and then that sorts it very quickly. So styling option wise, she goes nicely behind the ear, which I think now, I think now it looks really cute. 
and I'm saying I'm thinking yeah I, I can make this, make this wig work for me um so can tie her half up half down just about enough length there just about you might squeeze it a little bit but yeah so overall it is one of these stylish long layered bobs that will always always be the right answer to any event you're going to it will always it will always look chic and done up but not over the top so i think it is one of those that will just work for any occasion for me i think i need to see how she will sit on me when i wear her a little bit more often i love the color i think the color is really really lush really quite really well done loving the rooting and these highlights really nice for me i think when i first put her on i thought she will be my workhorse wig <laughs> don't know what if you know what i mean by that but for me it's one of those wigs i can just plug on and just do whatever it is i need to do go shopping do the cleaning do <sighs> go out wherever and just complete chores and do all of that and not worry about the hair um so yeah it's it's a it's a it's a nice classic bob i think i just need to live with it a little bit longer and i will give you an update in a few months time how i'm feeling about jameson so if you like the wig i wore at the beginning of the video that is the temptation wig by natural image um, I did a review on that and I will link it below in the, in the description box. But um, I have cut off quite a bit from that Temptation wig um, to make it a little bit more usable for every day. But otherwise, like and subscribe. Thank you so much for stopping by and see you soon. Bye! Mm -hmm.